Hey, what's going on guys? This is Push to Insanity and what you guys are watching today is another free 3D intro template tutorial. So go ahead and open up your first part of your template, which is the Cinema 40 file. To add your text, select both of the blue text layers and change the text to whatever you guys would like. Once you guys have changed the text, go to your render settings and save your intro to your own desktop so you guys can easily locate it once you guys have rendered it. And make sure that the file format that you guys are rendering it as is a QuickTime movie or any movie file. And once you guys have saved it, go ahead and render out your Cinema 40 part of your intro. Once you guys have finished rendering your Cinema 40 part of your intro, go ahead and open up the After Effects file. You guys are provided with the CC as well as the CS6. So depending on which version of After Effects you guys have, go ahead and open up that file. Now you guys will notice that you're missing three files which are all from your Assets folder. Go ahead and open up your Assets folder and right click any of the missing files and replace it with the footage that you guys are provided with in the download. So once you guys replace one of these footages, all of them will automatically be replaced. So it doesn't matter which one you guys replace first. And the footages are located in the footages folder. Now once you guys replace the footage, you guys will notice that the original intro template is there. And if you guys want to change this with your edited text, go to your name underscore cinema 40 dot movie file. Right click it and replace the footage with what you guys just rendered in cinema 40. And this will change your intro to your edited text. So once you guys are finished with that, you guys are ready to render your intro. So go to composition and add your composition to your render queue. And under output, make sure that you have audio output selected and you guys can render out your intro. Okay. 